All right, howdy, folks. Welcome back to the Freddie James Road to Glory series, episode 26. Got my Georgia gear on. We are facing Georgia Tech here today. Is the last game of the regular season. This team is number, well, not Georgia Tech. We are number two. Um, maybe we jump to number one. Probably not. We are going to play them at home, which is always exciting. We're going to keep working with, uh, we're going to keep working with our brand, boosting that up. We still have an open NIL slot. Um, we're up to 849,000 followers, so having a good time there. Uh, Georgia Tech is not a very good team, and uh, I feel pretty confident that we are going to run through them before we move on um, to the SEC Championship. I think we're going to face Auburn there, so we are going to get Auburn after all. Um, we didn't get them in the regular season, but let's get into this, man. As we wind our way toward the end of another college football season. Let's ball dogs. Looking for an 11 and 1 season. And the star of the team, Freddie James, comes out for the first time. Georgia Tech fighting to be bowl eligible. And they're going to get a stop here, third and 11. Well, not a stop yet. Now facing a third and long. To the air, it's Newman. He's caught his man. What a throw from Tommy Newman. He had a few blocks there. So Sakobi White continuing his good season, the leading receiver for the dogs. Newman. What was that? I don't know what he was trying there. Let's see what they've got on second and fourteen. This offense tried to go sprinkle right in motion the well right again. The air, and the defense was ready this time. He's got nitro, nitro close, not gonna quite get it. Hurry up into an inside zone here. Now play the next play. Played it aggressively. Went and got the sack. Way to respond. Oh, we start climbing something. <laughs> First down, a goal has been hit. Get some more XP. And a good tackle there. Priscilius, the backup tight end, is going to be running the Reed flat here. Goes Freddie, nowhere. A slow start for James. We score seven, though. Georgia Tech comes back and gets three. So that's something. Wide out in motion. Scobie in motion. To Riddell. Riddell's not going anywhere. Loss of two. And the defense coming with bad intentions. They knock him down for a loss. After getting knocked back to open this drive, it's second and twelve. Oh, and he threw it. Flatter than I thought. And it's third and twelve. Dogs left no doubt about who is king of the Peach State the last time these two met. Yeah, it was a beat down. It wasn't close. And listen, Georgia's had a lot of wins in this series. Georgia Tech's going to need to find some confidence. Not going to quite get there. To go good Tech gives it back. I need to go to slow. Got a nice little Texas route brewing here. Freddie holds on for six. Freddie's the third leading receiver on the team. First down. Oh, and he missed him. Nitro on the dig had the touchdown. A bad throw there. Second and ten. Dogs get the third and four here. Don't love this concept here. Shotgun snap on third down. He's got a man back in the end zone. Jeff Sprinkle, touchdown dogs. Come on now. The freshman comes through. And it'll be 14-3. Dogs take back over. 
from the gun, running back on the move. We get four. At the 25 after picking up four. It's just so nice to know you can start off on the first down with positive plays. Positive yards, hand the football off, set up a good second down. Caught in the backfield, it's James. Freddie beat him to the outside. First down, didn't call for that one. And even took a check down knowing Freddie could beat the end. Dogs pick up the first down through the air and the Georgia faithful starting to howl and bark. Yellow Jackets were starting to move. Maybe you get a little bit conservative. On a lineman there, couldn't get anywhere on that. Great defense, run the football. The reason that they broke over the middle and gets three. In the recent era, they became more. So third and five, and a first down for the Dogs, all the way to the 43. Got some hot players, Riddell, Kamalat. Power football with the run. And Freddie's got 12. Another XP goal completed. Another 675 there. He's got his tight end. Riddell, diving catch. Look at Tommy Newman slinging it around right now. Absolutely love to see that. Freddie's still being slowed. So Sprinkle running that wheel. Usually this goes to Tuggle, but that's not far enough for the first down. And man. And it's over the middle. Freddie's got it. And that's why he does so well. Comes back over the middle. Giving Newman an option, and that line protects him for long enough. Newman kept it, and he's going to lose one. Four linemen real tight here. As a quarterback, you've got to know in this area of the field, it's tough to throw, right? The windows, they open and close so quickly when you get down. Uh, Freddie runs hard, but can't get in. Tech run defense is, oh goodness, stout today. Wilcox loses a couple, and we actually don't score. First of the flat, it's only going to get one. Riddell's got five catches today for 39 yards. That's a, another eaten up run. We might just have to make it happen as the back here today. Not the first. Wilcox got stuffed again, and Tech's going to score. Wow. We went for it again. Why don't we just let Trey Flavors kick there? That one makes no sense to me. Hell, oh, Freddy, right over him. Six catches today for 65 yards already. Makes sense. Can't get anything going on the rushing end. to move it through the air feeling some heat Tommy I should have called for it I didn't mean to motion that sack gets this offense behind the chains it's second down he's got Riddell that's only gonna get four way too tight of a game here third and 15 to Kamalat um we did hit the field goal so it's 17 to 10. Tech's going to give it back to us after actually a pretty lengthy first drive here in the second half. They'll crank up this drive with the pass. Nice. Good throw. So Tuggles getting involved again. And he gets smoked at the flat. Get out there, Freddy. Boom. Nice. Great block. Third and inches. Run game hasn't been on for the dogs today. Big one here. It's going to be just enough. The one yard. That's all we need. To the ground, he's got it again. 
I don't know, man. I can't. I can't run right now. Looking for more out of the screen game. And I was going to get tackled anyway. Got caught on the line. He's got Tuggle. First down, and I like that front, but we're not going to be able to run the hurry up here. We actually have a false start. Running back goes in motion. He's looking to throw. And it's incomplete. If you're going to take a hit like that, you might as well hang on to the ball. This offense has a second down play. To Riddell. He's going to get about seven. He's had a big day. Looks like he might be hurt, though. And we do get the first. Tech's front has really held Freddy up well. Yeah, way late on that one. Riddell's been so involved in the game today. The officials offer the deal and the coach accepts it. They will take the penalty. Long drive continues as the offense keeps working the ball down the field. This is going to go to the receiver, I assume. As it should. Kamalat breaks one, and he's going to get about nine. They come back off the field. Third and five. So White going in motion. Just throw it to Freddy. Freddy's open. He jumps over, man. Touchdown. Dogs. Oh, man. Can't run today. His pass catching is next level right now. And we get a turnover quickly. Camel out on the post. I see it already. Now it's covered. He's got the dig. Jaden Riddell has had himself a day. Oh, we are so open. Touchdown. Two receiving touchdowns today. And just like that, this one is a 21-point game. Dogs are going to be 11-1 this season. If I think booked their ticket to the college football playoff. They finally get a few. Four, but a few. Hey, you waited way too long, Tommy. Some serious work to do if they want to convert this one. This is one of the reasons I love this linebacker. He is an outstanding pass rusher. He's Holy cow. I didn't even call for it. We've got 10 catches, 106 yards, and two touchdowns. What a receiving day it's been for Freddie. And as we switch ends of the field, let's take a quick look at the national rankings. 31 to 10. Oh, he got me with his arm. I thought I hit the block. Tuggle getting involved. That's happening in this game. They are just not getting the push they need all game long. And he's got the slant. Casey Kamalat down to the three. Freddy looking for his third touchdown of the day. He's in. Look at the XP filing in. 16 carries for 45 yards. That's not the best numbers. But we are happy about another score. Maybe we can break one off and really add. They'll ride the running back and leave it with him. There we go. That'll help. 16 yards there. 
chunk play to start this drive. Now they'll really try to take it to this defense. I don't think I'm beating him to the outside. I am actually. Though I'm not getting over that guy, though. So we get seven. All right, hey. 18 for 68. I'm happy with it. Must have been a big play down the field. To who knows who. From the shotgun, they'll run it. Oh. Can't get him oh, and he fumbled it. Oh, the ball squirts out. Oh, it looks as if the defense got it. And they'll Ready. get him down after a solid return. So, we fumble the ball. On the double. Take back over here. That's tough. They'll give it to the back. And he does a nice really eight. nice job finding open space and making a good gain before the stop is made. He's piled up 76 yards rushing. He continues to impress as he leads the nation in rushing. Tommy is not going to get the first. He's close. I love this play to Kamalat. They're bringing people down, but this also could be a touchdown. It's either a touchdown or you just lose a lot. It's touchdown. Tuggle missed the block, though. Camel out to the five. If Tuggle hit that block, that's touchdown. It worked beautifully. Touchdown. No. Wilcox is having a rough day. Newman to Sokovi White. Touchdown, dogs. So 41 25. We're going to keep the tech. Yellow Jackets away from bull eligibility. And we are going to move to a first down. Freddie shy of 100 yards. But he's close. Might get it here. Not there. <laughs> Take another timeout. Newman, actually the right idea there, pulling it. That's the, they have one of the ugliest mascots. So third and four. Tech out of timeouts. And Freddy's up over 100. Ball game over. Bye-bye, Georgia Tech. And that might be the last game we play here on our home turf. But the dogs win 41 to 25. Come on, man. Clean, old-fashioned hate. Georgia with 76 wins against them now. Yeah, this was a great game overall for the whole team. Newman was killing it. 36 for 41. With 416 yards and four touchdowns. That's insane. Rushing wise, Newman or Wilcox was awful. Freddie wasn't great, but he did score. Camelot for 25 yards as well. Freddie led all receiving with two touchdowns and 106 yards. Jaden Riddell was awesome. Casey Camelot had a great game. Sokovi wasn't big into this one. Uh, Jeff Sprinkle called a touchdown as well. Nice. Toggle with 53 yards. Oh, man. I want to bring one of them with me, um, one of my teammates with me into the Madden series. I'm trying to decide who. I'm thinking Kamalat, but I'm also thinking Jaden Riddell. Could be really good as well. So we advance the week. Into the SEC Championship week we go. It's going to be the Auburn Tigers. Oh, here we go. Here's another NIL thing. We're trying to offer some brand ambassadors for a new affordable electronic leg compression for the cost of two energy. For a reduction of four from... No. I don't use wear and tear because the wear and tear system is broke. Anyways, we're number two. Auburn's number five. Winner takes home the SEC championship in a first round bye in the college football playoff. I think we're pretty confirmed in regardless. I was number three as they beat Nebraska. 
this Kylan Fox guy had a four touchdown game. Stanford keeping their playoff hopes alive with a big win over Notre Dame. And so here in the college football, who was that? Vanderbilt beat Tennessee. Oof. So Tennessee drops to 12, and I don't know if they're going to be able to hold on through conference championship week. It's looking good for us to make it regardless, um, as it is for maybe Auburn as well. Um, UCF is still number one somehow. Iowa jumps to number three as they are headed to the Big Ten championship. Interesting. Heisman watch, uh, good day for Freddie, but not the best. Riley Trujillo still leads um, as he goes for seven passing touchdowns. That is insane. All right. We will uh, continue this in episode 27. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe. Well, yeah, subscribe to the channel. That's it for me. I don't know. That's Freddie James episode 26 in the books.